Well, hello again, ladies and gentlemen. This is your friend, No Way. A little bit different of a, a video this time. As you see, starting here, this is a weather map that is coming across the northeast of showing a front moving across the northeast of coming to the area where I live. Now, the purpose of this video is we have to talk about the elephant in the room. Now, we know that this front is coming through, okay? Many of the people out there, oh yeah, they're creating this. No. I will prove here today that they're not creating this front. But they are manipulating this front to either dry it up or make it produce more. Now, I had heard two days ago because of the the work I, I got to get done and that I'm doing outside and everything. You, um, you have to check your weather, especially when you're going to be working on the siding on the house. And so I, I knew a couple days ago this front was going to come through on, on this day here on Wednesday, the 24th of, uh, of May. So I knew this was coming through. Now, last night, Tuesday night, when I was taking our dog for a, a little walk so she can get her energy out and get, uh, you know, some exercise, and I can get some exercise, and I noticed planes flying overhead. And oh, yes, we know what I'm going to say next. So this morning, when I went outside, oh, look what is now accumulating again on the doghouse. Look at all these pretty little silvery dots. And as you see, that looks just like a cursed splat, <laughs> right? And all these little dots. I mean, last year I showed you and the thing was covered. And here's this one. This is the other side. As you see, there's, there's quite a lot of it. When I zoom down in, and it, it's starting to accumulate like it did last year. Okay. So, with this happening... What do you think is going to happen with this? If this stuff, and I'm going to show you here in a minute what this is all about and what they're doing that they're saying they weren't doing, but now they can't deny it because many of us are smart enough to check the websites of the information that is public information that's by law it has to be but they are banking on the majority of people get their news from propaganda media and propaganda websites and it doesn't matter this propaganda does not matter if it's right wing or left wing it's all propaganda all of it the left creates the lie and the right tries to debunk it and that's the fight back and forth so there's no truth coming out it's all propaganda it's all smoke and mirrors while they are poisoning you and I'm gonna show you here in a minute just some of the great chemical they are spraying in our atmosphere so in this what I wanted to show you as you see, we are at the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration Central Library. It is Weather Modification Project Reports. Uh, part of what happened, as it states down here, in the 70s, in 72, is part of, it's public law. They have to report to Congress. So, when you're looking at this, this is saying everything that they had 
uh, the government had said, the media had said, and everything that we have heard over the past few years about how we are all, uh, yes, these theorists says, 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 says that we don't know what we're talking about. It's the miss, dis, you know, about information. And so we're a bunch of wackos. But it's right here. It's public knowledge because it is public law. So what I wanted to show on this particular part is, yes, there is weather modification. Now, we're up here at the end. This is like page 90. And we're into the 2022, 2023. As you see on here, increased precipitation. American River Basin. American River Basin. These are rivers and stuff. They're claiming have... Um, they need more rainfall so we're going to modify as i had just showed you when the front's coming when the front's coming they will modify the front and create more rain or less rain now what is very disturbing when it comes to a lot of the san juan mountains San Juan Mountains. This is in California. We all know what just happened this past winter. So from November 1st of 2022 to April 15th of 2023, winter snowpack and precipitation augmentation, meaning they are going to increase it exponentially now what did we just hear about all the poor people in the sierra mountains the san juan mountains all through the the mountainous reason regions of california 60 to 70 feet of snow people were buried in their homes people couldn't move do you think that they cared about the people? No. Do you think they care now about the billions of dollars of property damage due to all the flooding that's occurring because of they caused it? So what I want to show you on this report, which is very telling to say the least, when you click on that blue, you see, look what appears. San Juan Mountains. But it's not just western San Juan Mountains. It's also southeast Utah Mountains and northern regions. Now, what is disturbing about this? They're talking about their what they're going to do and how they are going to create more snowpack in this and that modification material acetone solution of four percent acetone if you don't know what acetone is acetone is an acid this stuff will eat the paint and finish right off in anything. On the can, when you get it, usually it, it's hard. You, you don't just go down to a local store and pick up a can of acetone because it's that deadly and that poisonous. The fumes alone could eat the lungs right out of the human body destroy your sinuses this stuff is highly highly toxic so four percent of what they're spraying in the air that of course they said didn't and don't happen but it does 
4% of it is acetone. You've got silver iodide, iodide, and 1.25% sodium iodide. This is toxic in high levels. So, as you see, this is what they're creating. And, and they're, they're, they're talking about it. 3 grams per hour and 25 grams per hour, depending on cloud-based moisture and temperature. Cloud-based height and cloud type. So, when a front's coming in, they manipulate it, they modify it to fit what they want to do. So anything, so those pictures I showed you of the doghouse, it's starting again. What does that look like to you? To me, it looks like a silver iodide. You're looking at the silver and it's coating everything so it's not just coating the doghouse it's coating the leaves on the trees the grass on the ground oh if you're standing outside and what do you think's falling on you right so with this stuff going on and also while I was right here what I wanted to show you is this one they want to cool the earth. If we come back here and we come out to page 93, what's this last one right here? This is 2023. Air temperature reduction. So again, you click on this blue link and you get the form that is submitted to Congress and what is in this reduce global temperatures this is to reduce the average global temperature okay so within this we are deploying sulfur dioxide calcium chloride and other primary compounds and slash or other primary compounds into the stratosphere <laughs> See, to alter global warming. Our deployments that they're talking that they're going to do when you come down just a little bit okay Right here is a hundred megatons in total per year. They are going to spray a hundred megatons per year of sulfur dioxide and calcium chloride. into the atmosphere. Sulfur dioxide mixed with water gives you sulfuric acid. So what do we hear? Oh, we have such a problem with pollutants in the air and all these cars and these cow farts and all of this human activity. So when they're telling you global warming is because of human activity it's not you me it's not natural occurrences of, of cows and and your cars and your and it's them they're creating the acid rain so the dates you're seeing here when when you look up up here on this spot right here it's starting on 2-12-2023, 2 
and ending on 3-23-2023, or 22-23. So for the next 200 years, for the next 200 years, they want to spray 100 megatons of sulfur dioxide and calcium carbonate. Excuse me, it's not calcium chloride, it's calcium carbonate into the atmosphere. And this is going to stop global warming. So what they're saying, ladies and gentlemen, they're going to freeze the earth. They want to block out the sun and freeze the earth. And they know what they're doing. But yet they tell people like me and you and, you know, especially me talking about this ain't happening now. None of this. You're 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 a conspiracy. Um, yep, 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 yep. Right. I am spreading this and spreading that, which the man-made, you know what, is them doing it. So this is how the truth is there. If you're only listening to talking heads and right or left wing media or this or that or the government they're openly lying to you and manipulating you because they understand many of you are not smart enough to go to the website themselves go to what they call I got this straight from the horse's mouth itself because it's coming straight from them. So the next time you see the plane flying overhead and its chem and its calm trail does not dissipate within 10 to 15 seconds behind the plane, you are witnessing what I just showed you right here for the next two hundred years right here they want to spray a hundred mega tons of sodium of sulfur dioxide and calcium carbonate astounding isn't it and all of this is to reduce and alter global warming. So it's already happening, ladies and gentlemen. They're not going to tell you. And they don't want you to do this right here. So there we go.